Today's suggestion is going to help you go from this absolutely distorted trash sounding recording to a nice clean sounding live stream or recording like this. And now if I get really loud, it does not distort, still sounds fine, nice and clean. In order to resolve this, the first thing we'll look at is the audio interface. A lot of folks think that if their microphone is too quiet on their live stream, the first thing they should do is crank up the gain on their audio interface. The reason that this is incorrect is this is going to decrease the available headroom, meaning you can't get loud without distorting or clipping the microphone. For example, right now I have my gain set so I'm hitting around negative 10 to negative 6 dB. It sounds nice and full and loud, but then if I get excited and scream, it distorts and sounds terrible. In order to resolve this, I decreased the gain on my interface from 2 o'clock all the way down to 10 o'clock, and now I am no longer hitting negative 10 to negative 6 dB. I'm now hitting between negative 25 and negative 20 dB. In my opinion, the audio does sound great, but I am sure all of you notice that it is far too quiet. So we are going to have to use some filters in OBS to account for this. In order to do this in OBS, we will click the gear icon next to our microphone input. Then we'll select filters. And the first filter we're adding is gain, which is going to allow us to increase our level after the audio has been converted from analog to digital. For this example, I am adding 17 additional decibels of gain. Let me engage that. And now I am significantly louder, but even with this gain added after we have converted to digital, if I get really loud, you can see that the meter goes red and we start to encounter digital clipping. And in order to stop the digital clipping, we need to add something called a limiter. For this, I have the threshold set to negative 1 dB, meaning the audio will never exceed negative 1 dB, meaning we will never hit 0 dB, which is where the clipping begins. So now, if I get really excited, we don't clip ever. And here is a quick bonus. If you want to add a little bit more flavor, I have some compressor settings that I really like. These compressor settings model one of my favorite compressors of all time, the LA-2A. Now I have engaged the compressor. For this, I have the ratio set for four to one. Typically you would have three to one for the LA-2A, but we'll make do. The threshold is set to negative 16 dB. You can set this wherever you need to to get the desired effect. Attack of 10 milliseconds, release of 60 milliseconds, and the output gain of 0 dB, so we're not going to be boosting it at all. And here is how it sounds going from the gain filter into the compressor filter, and finally into the limiter filter. And now if I get really loud, it does not distort, still sounds fine, nice and clean. Hopefully that helped. I'll see you next week with another tip trick suggestion thing.